This is my video for the Rio Salado Multi-Gun held August 14th, 2021. The rifle starts chamber empty. Because I'm left-handed, I'm able to move to the front of the chopper and take up a good supported position bracing on that column. With the 300 yard targets out of the way, I engage the six hanging steel at 75 yards. Rifle on safe, I exit the chopper. Notice the rifle's handed off my right hand to discard it. My left hand's on my pistol to make it easy to acquire as I step into position. From this position, there are five steel. From this corner, I'm going to engage three steel. And then from the final position, there are two steel. Knowing where all the targets are and the minimum amount of positions to shoot from is what makes these stages fast. I am first in stealth two gun, giving me 100 match points. At the start here, there are two Texas stars with no shoot poppers on either side of them. I've done these before and I've taken out one star than the other. This time I attempted to just shoot them all at the same time, but it got a bit sloppy. Moving over here, we have six paper targets at close range. Uh, I'm shooting through the four power optic with both eyes open using it bend and aiming concept style. I deploy the bipod as I move to the table. I am shooting the long range 225 yard target first, the close range target, the 300 yard target, then the closer target again in a straight left to right manner. From here, the order changes up so it's close, far, close, far. On the last target at 300, uh, I recognize the wind has picked up a little bit and I'm hitting off to the right. Uh, the ground is wet from the rain the night before so it was more difficult to see that wind drift than normal. I am third in Stealth 2-Gun with 79.38% of the winner's score. This stage starts with six hanging steel that must be engaged offhand at about 60 yards. Once these targets are cleared, the shooter moves onto the bridge, and there are six paper targets that must be engaged without touching the railing. On this portion, I am using the Romeo Zero stacked on top of the Bravo 4. Because there are no shoots in play, I favor as high on the shoot targets as I can. Reload to my second magazine that's coupled as I exit the bridge, and from this position I must re-engage the hanging steel targets again. Uh, this engagement sequence goes a little bit better because I know where to hold on the targets. Safety on, I grab the ammo can, and now I have to transition over to the next bay, which is handgun only. It was pointed out to me a few shooters after I had completed the stage that the manner in which I engage these targets is actually against the stage description. I'm supposed to have discarded the ammo can first, then engage the targets. The stage description said then versus and. So those first four targets could have incurred procedural penalties, but because my score was already finalized, they were not added. But you can make the call if it was a competitive advantage or not to shoot one-handed versus discard the ammo can, then shoot with both hands. On this stage, I am fifth in stealth two gun with 64.87 percent of the winner's score this stage has eight poppers and two plate racks of six targets each that must be neutralized uh, the barrels downrange prevent the shooter from seeing all of them at once and you're going to be shooting at a lot of angles to hit all of them one of the problems with being left-handed on a stage like this is it's hard to come up with a stage plan um, your squad mates really can't help you out to the same degree because for me, I want to go through the stage like this right to left to keep my muzzle oriented downrange where everyone else is going to go through the stage left to right. So I default to going into each window and looking hard left to hard right, and I have it actually engaged and neutralized all the targets. Dude, I can only do that with my shoes and socks off. <laughs> all right, if you're finished, unload and show clear. I'm fourth in stealth two gun on this stage with 70.73% of the winner's score. Not bad for not having a plan other than just engage all the targets as I see them. In the end, I'm third in stealth two gun out of 16 shooters with 82.22% of the winner's score. Overall, I am 12th out of 72 shooters with 71.97% of the winner's score. Thank you for watching. Come back again for more match and multi-gun competition content.